Hey, what's up everybody? I hope you're having an awesome day and are hype for Pokemon Sword and Shield and have the most fun playing it because right now we're going over five rare Pokemon and how and where to catch them. But not just any five rare Pokemon, but five rare brand new generation eight Pokemon. So if that's something you're into, then stick around, watch the whole video and leave a like if you truly do enjoy. And if not, let me know why and what I can improve on down below. And let's get right into it because coming in in, first on our list is Impidimp, the Glimwood Tangle Troll, the freaking live stream troll, the fairy dark type Pokemon can actually be obtained a little earlier than Glimwood Tangle, actually a lot earlier, over at the Motostoke outskirts with a 5% non-overworld encounter, and there's a cave right next to the Motostoke outskirts, so you could just uh, keep resetting, keep resetting, and uh, if you don't get enough random encounters or something weird like that, but Impidimp evolves into Morgrim at level 32, and into the awesome, awesome Grimmsnarl at level 4. 42, which also has a sick, amazing Gigantamax form. And if you want to know more about that, there's going to be a future guide soon. And if it's already out by the time you're watching this in regards to the Gigantamax guide, it's going to be a card up above you can click or down below. But anyways, let's get into our next extremely rare Pokemon because this Pokemon has a 1% chance of spawning. And this Pokemon is Sizzlepeed crawling their way onto the list. I hate myself. Um, this fire bug Pokemon, fruit, <laughs> this fire bug fruit roll-up Pokemon has an insanely small 1% random encounter rate, but is so worth it considering how epic its Gigantamax form is, which you get access to if you get lucky enough to catch a Gigantamax Senti Scorch in the Dynamax Max Raid battles. Sizzlepeed evolves into Senti Scorch at level 28, so get it early because by the time you're at the next few gyms, you'll have this awesome Sending Scorch in your hands. Next, I gotta show love to the awesome Poison Electric Pokemon Toxel. Toxel can be found with a 5% overworld encounter in the Bridgefield part of the wild area. You get access to this part of the region after defeating the second gym leader, Nessa. Just make sure to bring some strong Pokemon with you. Toxel evolves into Toxtricity at level 30, and he is so freaking cool. He's like the punk rock Pokemon. Like, literally in his entry, it says punk Pokemon. On, and that is so cool to me. I freaking love this generation so much and I, I truly hope you guys are enjoying it as well and I hope you enjoyed this next Pokemon on the list because I want to go back to Glimwood Tangle because that is where our next rare Pokemon makes its home and I'm talking about the Pokemon in DD. and although it doesn't evolve it does actually feature two gender differences and great type coverage being psychic and normal. Now through random encounters we have a 5% chance at getting a look at this awesome also, Pokemon only ever seen in Pokemon Center. So if you want to get it, you got to do a little bit of grinding, a little bit of random encounters, but you should get it in no time. 5% chance, not too bad. But if you do want a Sinistee, on the other hand, you got to do a little more grinding because bringing it all together, we have the Ghost Teapot Pokemon Sinistee. You should all remember because Poltegeist is its actual final stage evolution and became very popular during the pre release reveal trailers and holds an extremely low encounter rate of 1%. So if you fell in love with this Pokemon during those reveal trailers, then get ready to do some grinding. Sinistee evolves into Poltegeist with the use of two items, depending on if you want a cracked or chipped form of Poltegeist. And according to the game data, the cracked and chipped pots are a particular teapot that can make a certain species of Pokemon evolve. It may be cracked, but tea poured from it is delicious and that is just the in-game excerpt taken from the game. So if you want a more in-depth guide on how to evolve Pokemon, how to evolve Alchemy, Sinistee, and other Pokemon that may have special evolution features as well as Obstagoon, be sure to check out our video coming out soon. It's going to be linked down below or the card right here whenever that is made available to you. <laughs> And with all this wrapped up, I'm going to show some gameplay from my live stream of me using Grimstarl in a Gigantamax raid. I hope you all enjoy. Thank you so much for watching. Check out our playlist down below for some new guides. Here's some awesome footage of Grimstarl. I love this Pokemon so much, and I love you for watching. It's a privilege to have the opportunity to educate you on my favorite Pokemon games so far. Uh, have a good one, and I hope you enjoy this heckin' footage. <laughs> Yo, what the heck?
<laughs> Hold the heck in heckin' phone. Dude, I'm going. I'm going. I'm going. Please, please, please. Uh, I'm going. <laughs> Hopefully, I have this. Please tell me I have this part of the wild area. Please, 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 please. Where is it? Wait, hold up. What? Where is it on the bridge? No way. Is it on the bridge? I'm so confused. Motostoke Riverbank. No way. Okay, I didn't think so. I was like, what? All right, all right. Can you not ride Pokemon? You cannot ride Pokemon in this, but your bike is really good. <laughs> what is this? I don't know what this is, but we're going to take Grimstar to the battle. And uh, I don't know. I, it, it's a rare type of Pokemon, though. Uh, the bike does look really good. Oh my god. Marini. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Let's go. Uh Shroomish, I can tell. I was wrong. I can't tell. But yeah, the bike and uh, my bike isn't even all the way upgraded. Wait, is that a gig I don't think it's a Gigantamax. What is that? Oh, I think it's a uh, it's a new Pokemon. Um, that's a Dynamax. And I'm gonna use wait. What type is this Pokemon? I don't even know what type of Pokemon this is. I'm going to use Max Darkness. Guys, watch how sick this is. Marini is Gen 7. Oh, is it Gen 7? Okay, I never, I only played through it once. I'm an idiot. Poison Water. Hey, Everlasting. Thank you. Okay. Um, Water Poison. Okay, okay. Thank you, guys. Alright, so now we wait. <laughs> because you could Dynamax and use a move, but you don't use the move until your next turn, unfortunately. <laughs> Alright. A mysterious barrier. Oh yeah, yeah. So when you Dynamax, there are like gauges around the Pokemon. Oh my god. <laughs> uh, there are gauges around the Pokemon, and uh, one move takes away one gauge slot, but a Dynamax move takes away two, which is very epic. I've got to head out, but I hope the rest of your stream goes well. Hey, peace out, Zelda. You thank you for stopping by. I appreciate you, and I hope you have a good one. Yo, what? Does Magikarp know Hydro Pump? <laughs> Bye, Zelda Mew. Wow, I love playing a game without drifting. Bro, look how beast this is. Like, what? Hello? <laughs> Grimstar? <laughs> Grimstar is so dope. Freaking love this Pokemon. Oh, yeah, I gotta get more Pokeballs. Oh my god, I can't forget. Yeet ball. <laughs> Bye, Zelda Mew. All right, we caught it, which is beast. Let's see. I just want to see the rewards we get. I want to make my Grimmsnarl seem extremely uh, strong. Um, so we got to oh, we got toxic spikes, which is really good. Uh, Zelda Yeet. Oh my god. Next. All right. Oh, wait. I want to try to find a Gigantamax Pokemon, though. That's what I really want. So let's keep going. Oh, that was weird. Um, let's see. I like how I, I was able to see the Gigantamax or the rare Max thing from like so far away, too. That was really cool. All right. Um, Sandstorm. I can't see anything. <laughs> All right, I'm looking. Oh, here we go. I've never been over here. I, I haven't seen this yet. Find that, oh yeah, isn't there, oh wait, no, the increased chances don't start till tomorrow. I can't wait to start over though and play uh, Shield. I'm excited. Cause yeah, at 12 o'clock, I'm playing Shield. That's the move. I don't know how to evolve my ass.